are going to be seeing really pleasant conditions to be outside as we head through the day heading out this morning. Just a little bit of patchy fog, but off in our far southeastern side of the state, just out of central Indiana. If you'll be heading that way, that's where the fog is the thickest. So just keep that in mind if your travels take you into southeastern Indiana. Like Guardian radar, though, we're dry. You don't need any rain gear if you're about to head on out the door for the morning hours. We're at 70 degrees comfortable in Indianapolis, 66 in Peru and 65 in Bloomington. Dew point temperatures are elevated, but they're not terrible considering that just a couple weeks ago we had these in the 70s up to 80 degrees mid 60s. You certainly feel the humidity, but it's even down about 5 degrees from where we were this time just yesterday morning. So we'll be a touch humid as we head through the day today. Temperatures by noon in the mid 80s. If you're going to be eating outside, it's going to be a warm afternoon hot as we get into the late afternoon with a high temperature of 90. Very small chances for rain. As we head into the afternoon hours, we'll have increasing clouds through the morning. Future view tries to bring a couple of isolated showers around as we head through the afternoon. Maybe an isolated thunderstorm develops, but even that chance is very slim. And if it does, it would be non severe and it's not going to last long. So nothing that should wash out any plants by any means on into the evening hours. We'll stick with those partly cloudy skies. 10 o'clock, we'll see those temperatures back down into the lower 80s. If you're looking for a good day to get to the lawn, well, hopefully you don't have to do that kind of labor here on Labor Day, but maybe that's something you enjoy. Good weather, but very warm for it today. Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, we're going to mark those as fair because you will get some dry time in there, but you also have to dodge some periods of rain. So let's talk about the timing on that. We brought future view back up starting it at 8 a.m tomorrow morning. We'll have a mix of clouds around and we'll start to see those chances for rain coming up as we get into the late morning, early afternoon. This is 1230 PM and a couple clusters of some showers and a couple of thunderstorms will be possible as the system lifts north into the afternoon. This is three o'clock tomorrow and then as we get into the evening that would be clearing on out as we get into Wednesday. We'll bring back a couple rounds of showers and storms. The first one as we head through the morning commute, this is 630 AM, a couple of downpours again with some thunderstorm activity possible as we get into the late morning, early afternoon. We're drying back out before round two comes Wednesday afternoon. This is 530 PM and this will mark that transition back into some cooler temperatures. Some of these storms as we get into Wednesday, especially into the afternoon and evening, we'll have that chance to be on the stronger, maybe gusty or something something we'll watch very closely. High of 90 today. That looks to be the warmest for quite some time. 89 tomorrow and we'll continue to trend down with these temperatures as we head throughout the week. 85 for your Wednesday and Thursday. Still some dry time in there, but a few storms will be possible as well. I have 80 on Thursday, 78 and sunshine on Friday and 79 on Saturday. The Indians return home for a homestand as we get into tomorrow on through the weekend. We're going to have some great weather for it so you can enjoy some sunshine and cooler temperatures later on in the week.